It's a media mini. You'll see how to annotate student faces when they need to be edited to ensure student safety or address parental concerns. There are three ways to annotate faces in photographs used for media productions. First, you can use an annotation tool, such as Skitch, to pixelate the facial area. Open the image, open the Skitch application, select the screen snap option to capture the portion of the image you wish to use. Select the pixelate tool and select the faces or features you wish to hide. Once done, use the export option to save this new version of your image. The second option makes use of tools available in your computer's image preview. Open the image or JPEG. Duplicate before you begin to make sure you keep an original version. Set the original aside. Select the toolbox to access tools. Select the shape tools and pick the one you wish to use. Select colors for the shape, inside and outside line. Resize the shape. Move the shape to cover fa facial features you wish to hide. You can copy and paste to cover additional facial images. Finally, rename the image to show it's been annotated. The third image option is available in Photos if you're using a Mac computer, where you can access the markup tools. First, make a copy of your image to retain an original before editing. Select the Show Editing Tools option from the Image menu. Select the Extensions option and pick Markup. This opens similar tools to those found in Preview. Select a shape, change colors, and place the shape where it needs to be to hide a face or image feature. You can also use the Pen tool to color over elements that should be hidden. Make sure you save any changes and then export your annotated image for use in your media project. These are three quick ways to annotate images and cover student faces or features that need to be hidden from public view. This has been a Media Mini on annotating images and facial features.